Ah, uh, good morning. <laughs> Although it's almost noon. It's around 11 o'clock. Uh, I'm just starting the day today. Uh, yesterday, I spent most of the day uh, upgrading um, the front room's uh, computer uh, from Kubuntu uh, 10, Kubuntu 11.4 to 11.10. Uh, I did the library before Christmas in December, and I just now started to do the um, the other systems. There's three other systems that I have to upgrade. Uh, the one that I usually do the video commentaries on in the front room, uh, that's what I upgraded uh, yesterday. I will be posting a test comment from it sometime later today. So I want to check out all the different uh, uh, parts of it to make sure that everything's working all right. When you do any upgrade from uh, one version to the next, you need to sort of check things out to make sure that uh, everything's in working condition. So uh, today is still pretty much a bug check for the computer. Now, a lot of people complain about uh, the uh, the bugginess of uh, Linux and so on and so forth, but uh, it really depends on where you're coming from in terms of what you want to do with Linux uh, or your computer that determines whether you're a Linux person or a Windows person. Uh, I will answer a uh, comment that came that was put out by somebody else. It wasn't necessarily aimed at me, but it was it was uh, something that I found. Uh, on some of these uh, Linux reviewer sites about Linux as compared to Windows 7. I will answer, answer that in uh, a new show that I'll be putting out coming out on Friday uh, geared towards the Linux crowd. It is not going to be this new show that's, uh, uh, that's coming out on Friday is not going to be a Linux review show the way a lot of people will do screencasts or they will review certain things. This is not going to be that. My decision with Linux is not to simply uh, complain about, oh, this is wrong, this is wrong, and this is wrong. My perspective is, is that I'm going to become a developer. I'm in the process of organizing what needs to be done first and then organizing a good IDE, a good uh, uh, development environment. So once that's done, um, I will begin developing. Then that should be about a month or so. I should be stepping into the Linux development arena uh, instead of simply complaining about it. So the the path I'm going to be taking uh, is first to start the Linux show on Friday, which will contain the comments about uh, the differences between Linux and Windows 7 or the upcoming Windows 8, uh, which would a person choose and why would a person choose, that's going to be in that show on Friday. And today I still have a lot of uh, sort of cleaning up to do. Every once in a while, uh, and I'll show you this uh, with the uh, backroom camera, uh, when I take, take the portable back into the warehouse, uh, I'll show you what the problem is it, 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 that comes up with being a freegan. Every time you recycle something, uh, or you're interested in that, doing this type of recycling, you have to process it. The things have to be cleaned up. They have to be processed. And if you if something happens that you can't do it right away and you put it to the side, then that project that becomes a project that has to be done. And projects, the uh, the recycling processes uh, get backed up, and this is what I'll show. You. So what I'll be doing is I'll be processing the bins I got uh, last week. Uh, I'll be processing, so you'll see that, and you'll see some of the uh, the processing that goes on uh, when you when you are a freegan. So it's not a simple yank it out of the garbage and use it is yank it out of the garbage and clean it up refurbish it and then reuse it so there is a, a bit of uh, hands-on uh, 
necessity when you're doing freegan work. So I'll leave that uh, everything in, the, in my later comments to later. So this is it for now. We'll see you later on today.